Hello friends, welcome to my another video. In this video, I'm gonna talk about how to install LMMS and start making your own music on Linux Mint. The LMMS stands for Linux Multimedia Studio and and let's first see how to install this. So just open the command line terminal and as it's available in the repository you can install it directly through apt-get install command uh, or you can use the software manager so just type here sudo apt-get install lmms hit enter give your password press y and enter again So the Linux Multimedia Studio is now installed. I'm going to close this terminal. Uh, let's click on menu and search here. LM. Yes, here's the Linux Multimedia Studio. Let's launch this. Just create the working directory. That's that's into my home folder. Uh, this is the general setup for LMMS. Uh, the buffer size you should just slide this to to have a good sound quality, or you should have high latency. Uh, other settings. Uh, this is the working directory. This is the plugin directory, artwork, blah 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 and this is the user interface effects versus performance I'm, I'm going to leave this everything all this is for the keyboard uh, anyway so uh, click ok ok um, please note that the most changes won't take effect until you restart LMMS ok yes uh, you can see there is a, a song editor window, beat, bass line editor, that is control rack and uh, mixer. So you begin with creating your new project here. Just you can use control and shortcut key and on the left side here's the different instrument plugins that you can use here uh, there is uh, already different cool songs covers that you can use uh, there is all the steps uh, these you can use for your projects here's the samples basses beats drums these are all samples that you can use uh, in your editor. Let me click on any one of this. Drums. Anywhere. And for the song editor, uh, there is default preset. Next, I'm going to play any song here. Um, double click, and you can see the track here. You can even edit it, or you can save this for your own project. just a new learner for this uh, multimedia studio but uh, if you want to know about this you can just check check its help page online 
uh, you can go through its documentation here and then you would be able to create a decent music with this uh, multimedia studio and uh, uh, that's all for now friend I hope this video was helpful for you thanks for watching